Hello everyone. Hope you are doing well. So here we have another jumble sentence question. So the direction for the question is there are four sentences labeled one, two, three, four, one, two, three, and four. So these are the sentences that we can find out here. So uh, when they are properly sequenced, would uh, produce a coherent paragraph and decide on the proper sequencing of the order of the sentences and the key in the sequence of the four numbers as your answer, right? So let's look at the each of the sentences and understand that how they are connected. The first one indicates the concept of free will implies the ability to make independent choices not dictated solely by prior events or circumstances. Second one, compatibilities argue that free will and determinism can coexist with the free choices arising within the constraints of a deterministic universe. Third, the debate on free, uh, the debate on free will has significant implication for our understanding of morality and responsibility for our actions. Fourth, determinism suggests that all events are predetermined by a chain of cause and effect relationship, leaving no room for free will. Okay, so let's look into it. Um, if we look at the first one, the first one introduces introduces the concept of free will. The concept of concept of free will. Free will, isn't it? So uh, that is what we can find out. The concept of free will. Uh, that's what it introduces here. So second, which we can find out here is called as a option four. Option four, uh, that point out, determinism suggests that all events are uh, predetermined by a chain of cause and effect relationship, leaving no room for free will, isn't it? So what we can find out here, the concept of free will, and we find out a suggestion on that free will that all events are predetermined by a chain of cause and effect relationship, leaving no room for free will. So this follows by explaining the opposing concept of what? Opposing concept of what? Opposing concept of determinism. Isn't it? Concept of free will. Free will. Right. So um, you can say that what? Uh, and determinism can coexist also, right? Within free choices arising with the constraints of a deterministic universe. So uh, if we look into the next one, the next one stated that uh, um, uh, we can find out here, um, um, the next one would be, uh, yeah. So option one, we said about the concept of free will. Second, we talk about that uh, determinism suggests to four is the next one because this follows uh, by explaining the opposing concept of determinism, right? Next, we can find out option two, which is stated, compatibilists argue that free will and determinism can coexist with three free choice arising within the constraints of a deterministic universe. Isn't it? So, um, this uh, you can say that uh, introduces this introduces the compatibilist view. What is that uh, compatibilist view? Uh, the compatibilist view uh, can be called as a six to reconcile, reconcile free will and determinism. Isn't it? So that's what you can find out in option two and which will be nothing but called as option three. So um, then after we can find out uh, the debate, the debate which is uh, given here. The debate on free will has significant implication for our understanding of morality and responsibility for our actions. And this can be called as a conclusion. And this concludes by highlighting what? By highlighting the importance of the debate on free will in relation to morality and responsibility. Hence, we can say the sequence 
could be better by stating that what one, four, uh, then after two and three, isn't it? One, four, two, three. That would be the proper sequence. And sorry, mm. uh, proper sequencing, right? Which can come to the idea that uh, the first one introduces the concept of free will. Uh, second, we can find out uh, um, the concept of free will on what? That independent choice is not dictated solely by prior event or circumstances. Uh, option four said that determination uh, suggestion that all events are predetermined right, by a chain of cause and effect relationship, leaving no room for free will. So this opposing concept of free will. Then the option two stated com introducing compatibilist view, right? They seek uh, uh, reconciliation, reconcile, right? And three, so as we find out the debate between the compatibilist and determinism, so three stated that the debate on free will has important implication for our understanding of morality and responsibility for our action. Hence, the answer should be one, four, two, three. Hope you understood this. That's all. Thank you.